skepticism on the streets of Spain's capital after a mock vote for independence in the country's Catalonia region. It is totally undemocratic. They have not asked all Spaniards. Catalonia is ours. It belongs to Spain. About 80 percent of people said they favored breaking away from Spain and creating a new country, but only about a third of the people who could have voted went to the polls. Last week, a court suspended the planned vote, but the regional government held it anyway. It is illegal. For the moment, it has no legal validity, but something must be done because almost two million people have voted. Nationalism is a romantic idea, but I reckon nowadays it is not possible. From the economic point of view, it cannot be supported. Even in Barcelona, the capital of Catalonia, residents had mixed opinions on the vote. As a citizen, I feel very moved because it was a success in terms of participation. And either we voted yes or no, what counts is that we have the opportunity to decide. The secessionist movement has grown during Spain's economic downturn, but those who organized the vote remain upbeat. I asked the people in the world, I asked the media, and I also ask the democratic governments in the world to help the Catalan people to decide its political future. Sunday's mock vote was the latest pro-independence demonstration in the wealthy region, fiercely proud of its own traditions and language. Matt Friedman, Associated Press.